to or welcome back to my channel today i'm going to be showing you guys my full long overdue curly hair routine <laughs> My hair gets like this when it's dirty. I've been putting a lot of product in it. I've been sleeping on it. I've been pulling it back into like a low bun or in a pony, just trying to keep it out of my face. And my hair is overdue for a wash. So today I'm going to be showing you guys, starting with what I have in my shower, the products that I use, for my curly hair routine and then also when I am out of the shower products that I use and how I style my hair and all of that good stuff so um let's just get into it I'm gonna show you guys what I have in my shower hi girly so I'm switching over to voiceover so I can tell you guys about what's in my shower so this is all that I won't be using everything that's in here but I do think it's important for us to have multiple conditioners to really hydrate the hair so um, I'm just going in with this shampoo detangler who knew that was a thing but I'm lathering this all over my scalp and I don't think it's necessary to put condi or, uh, shampoo all throughout your hair, uh, just mainly on the scalp. And then I'm going to use their lubricating conditioner and this is going to help hydrate and soften the hair to help brush through it later. And on top of that, I do use some of this Olaplex conditioner to really, really hydrate the hair. I only use that about once every like two weeks. It's not necessary to use every time you wash, but I am brushing through the hair all the way from the top of the head down to the bottom of the hair and just rinsing all of that out. Now, this next product, this, I love how this feels on my scalp. This is a mix and fix bundling spray. Curl Wow, they just have a lot of good products and they sent some of this over to me. It's not sponsored, but I absolutely love this line for curly hair. The way this feels on my scalp, it's like, I can't even explain it. It feels so nice, um, great for oils. Also, this pump right here is a vital natural serum. So this also mimics natural oils to help moisturize all of your hair. And so I'm just rinsing all of that out and then I am securing it up in a claw clip. And that's it. That is what I do in the shower. So now that I am out of the shower, my hair is still in this claw clip and I just go straight to putting in some curl cream. So my hair is still pretty wet and damp, but I like to go back in with some water, which is really annoying, but my hair needs to be a little bit more wet for me to put these products in. I'm just going to spray both sides and i'm just going to use the shea moisture curl cream i'm just gonna mix it in i use a lot and i'm just going to get this side and the other side and now i'm just going to use this brush this brush is from a small business and i'll make sure that they're tagged down below but i love this brush so basically what i do here is where my curls naturally just kind of form one by one i just start i just start brushing them together and then i'll run my hand through it like that to make sure that they are closed if that makes sense so it's just instead of them being separate i am squishing them together basically with my hand like that so i go through my whole head doing this each of these i just clamp them together Okay, so 
So once that's done, I like to go in with some more curl cream just to make sure that it's all locked in place like this. I don't want to mess up, you know, that clamping that I did with the brush earlier. So I'm not like raking it through, but just kind of layering it on top and like kind of just squeezing it. Then I like to take this Curl Boost and I just spray it on top and throughout the hair. I like to take Curl uh, Gel, any sort of Curl Gel, and I'm almost out of this. And what I like to do is just put some in my hand. And then this is where I start scrunching my hair. So I'll start scrunching it. I'm going to completely flip my hair over. Okay, so my curls are pretty much the way that I want them to be. Scrunching them. And so now what I like to do is take a hair towel. So I take this one, this one is just your microfiber hair towel. And I just flip my hair over again and start scrunching it with this towel just to dry the hair. You know, your hair holds memories. So when I'm drying and scrunching it, this is how I want it to hold once it's dry. Okay, so I had to change really quickly because I have to go to the nail appointment. But I let my hair air dry after I scrunch it with the towel and I'll show you what it looks like after. Okay, so I'm back from my nail appointment. I got these square shapes. I just wanted to do something simple and nice. I love them. Okay, so this is my hair a few. Um, Hours later, it's still a little damp, like on the inside. The bottom of it is definitely dry. Let me show you guys in the restroom. So this is my hair a few hours later, all dried. They look so pretty. Um, so this is my natural curly hair. like this video please let me know if you have any questions down below don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and follow me all on all of my other socials i love you guys so much thank you for clicking on and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye.